Alright guys, so this is our Model 3 and it's starting to have a pretty weird smell and I think it's going to be the filter. So we got these ones here for replacements and it's like a pretty good non-OEM brand. We got a little installation guide. So this is going to be for the Model 3 and maybe the older model wise. I'm not sure about the newer ones, but definitely the Model 3. And here we have the instructions of how to get to it, remove it, and change them. So <laughs> there's quite a few there, but it shouldn't be too hard. There are two filters and also a tool. So first things first, let's remove this all-weather mat. And if we look inside, hopefully you guys can see, I got this light here. We're gonna have to take this panel off here. So it should just pop off. I'm gonna try to grab it here on top. And sure enough, it is popping off. It does need some persuasion, but it does come out. And you guys can kind of see the clips that are holding it down. So let's get this out of the way. And now we can go under here, and if you guys can see right back here, this door right here, that's what we need to open, which we can use the little included tool to get that little bolt out right there. So let's go ahead and break it loose, and then just unscrew it. There we go. Now it should just bolt this door right off. And now we can see our filter right there. And there's actually two of them, they're stacked on top of each other. This is the bottom one, and then there's another one on top. So what we're gonna do is just gonna pull on these tabs and try to pull them out. It is kind of a tight fit, but they do come out. And that's actually the top one, and we have one on the bottom. We've got to raise up and also pull out. So there's kind of limited room on the top. You have to kind of force it down, bend them a little bit, but they do come out some force a little bit and here they are go ahead and see if we can look at them a little better okay so this looks like the inside part let's see the other side yeah I can see they're a little dirty but not crazy dirty there's some dirt in there actually and this car is about 10 months old so getting there and you can see yeah they are pretty dirty but the main part is that it just stinks so let's go ahead and open our new ones and you guys can see the new ones are a little bit different we do have more of a hard shell here Hopefully they'll still fit in there. And you guys can probably see those little tiny carbon balls in there. And that's what neutralizes the smells. And then we got the filter on this side. Alright, so the carbon is going to go like this. And the filter is going to go that way like that. So, And then the tab is going to go towards the top. Because these are more hard, they're a little bit more tricky to get through here. So if you want to make it easier for yourself, you might need to take this panel out right here on the top. But I'm going to try to squeeze mine in without it. And you guys hopefully can see there it goes through. Just a little bit tight, but it does go in. <laughs> so I have to be a little bit more forceful. But once you get it in there, you just let it kind of fall down and you can see the strap there. It'll be the only thing showing up here. And then the second one will just go on top of that one. And the strap will be towards the top. So these are nice because you can pull them out later a lot easier. Just raise them up and it comes out. And there we go, now we just need to kind of tuck these little straps to the side or down. And then we can put the lid back on, which just kind of slides up, and then it goes down, and then we put our bolt back in here, down here. And now we can just tighten it, and as simple as that, our filters are in. So now we just gotta put the trim back on. Pretty simple, because it just clips on. Just gonna line it up, just kind of push on it to clip it in. And simple as that, guys, we are done. So let's go ahead and turn on the air conditioning, which I did turn it off by the way before I started pulling everything apart. So we are on, and it seems like the smell is gone. Well that's great. So if you got something smelly going on, change your filters and they'll probably fix it.